Let's just cut across to uh, some breaking news that's coming in. In fact, this to do again with airlines, but in another episode, a mid-air horror refuses to end because a woman finds a stone in her Air India food and she said that this negligence is unacceptable. Air India, of course, under the lens again. Remember, the scrutiny is coming at a time where just a couple of days ago, we saw the airline in dock for that uh, infamous being scandal as well. So here, this time around, the woman in question has said ensure stone-free food in Air India. In fact, she shared some pictures as well, taking to Twitter to complain about a piece of stone that she found in a meal served to her. In fact, uh, she said in that particular tweet, and I quote, you don't need resources and money to ensure stone-free food, Air India. This is what I received in my food served on flight AI215 today. Crew member was informed this kind of negligence is unacceptable. Let me cut across to uh, Ila to give us a sense of this particular episode that did transpire. Ila, you know, um, in the past couple of days, we've been just talking about airlines and, of course, customers going through a harrowing experience. Now, this one again coming to light where Air India is already under scrutiny for the other infamous scandal. But talk to us about the fact that now this customer has spoken, this passenger rather, has spoken about finding stones in her food and saying that this negligence is unacceptable. Well, absolutely, this negligence is un unacceptable. And uh, let me tell you that this is not the first in this incident where the customer has to go through uh, harassment. And we have seen the incidents keep increasing time to time. And this is so inconvenient uh, for the people who are traveling because when they are traveling, they are uh, ha heading towards wo their work or they are having some important meeting or some important task or work. So it gets affected. People's life gets affected. I will also try to get more people here. So, uh, so Pratik, where are you heading to? Uh, so, I'm heading to Spain uh, for my college, and I have heard that uh, your uh, the one flight that missed uh, missed actually 40 passengers. It's uh, really disheartening. Like, if 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 it has happened to me, it's like very saddening. And uh, I I think the airport services and government should do for them something. At least get them next flight as quickly as possible because it is uh, like they have made so much arrangements and done a lot of packaging and, do, and hard work for that thing and they missed it. Uh, they should look at the action like uh, seriously what happened and do this. And Air India ke food maybe stone mila hai. Uske mm. baare mein bhi kya kuch kena chenge food jis tarah se provide kya jata hai. And passengers are getting the stone in that food. Yes, I have heard recently ki like kitna zada matlab air uh, flights mein quality or services degrade ho ja rahi hai din ba din. Uh, food ho or like seating arrangement, seating uh, luggage ka bhi kafi zada broken mil raha hai. Not just food. So, or food, I mean, it's so much important that if you get a kanker in it, then how will it go? Like, in that case, at least, they are doing a lot of other airlines, they are doing a lot of their level up, they are upgrading their food, and they are decreasing it. So, it's not good for the passengers, and certainly, eventually, with the time, they lose all their happy customers. So, I think they should take serious action for the kids, for the kids, for the parents, for the passengers. Oh, well, sure. absolutely right. So, see, the thing is that the passengers who are traveling in the uh, airplanes and airlines with the airlines, so they are least expecting that the food should be good, the quality of food, the quality of services should be at least a uh, bare minimum and uh, should be good as they are paying a high fees for that and that is what the passengers are expecting but we are seeing that from past few days how incidents are occurring at airlines and uh, at the flights which is harassing the people which are harassing the passenger and that is what is upsetting the passenger right now and they are saying that some kind of guidelines or some kind of warning should be issued so that airlines should not take passengers for granted. Over to you. Absolutely, Ila. Like you put that out, at the end of the day, you know, customers are also paying a hefty amount for whatever service uh, that they are trying to acquire. But the other side, if you look at the service that's being uh, provided is disappointing. But for the moment of that, we leave it and